Hi guys, welcome to another audio video and I'm reading Ezekiel 2 of the King James Version Bible and it reads And he said unto me, Son of man, stand upon thy feet and I will speak unto thee. And the Spirit entered into me when he spake unto me and set me upon my feet and that I heard that that I heard him that speak unto me. And he said unto me, Son of man, I send thee to the children of Israel, to a rebellious nation that hath rebelled against me. They and their fathers have transgressed against me even unto this very day. For they are impudent children and stiff-hearted. I do send thee unto them, and thou shalt say unto them, Thus saith the Lord God, and they say, and they, whether they will hear, or whether they will forbear, for they are a rebellious host, yet shall know that there hath been a prophet among them. And thou, son of man, be not afraid of them, neither be afraid of their words. Though briars and thorns be with thee, and thou dost dwell among scorpions, be not afraid of their words, nor be dismayed at their looks, though they be a rebellious host. And thou shalt speak my word unto them, whether they will hear, or whether they will forbear, for they are most rebellious. But thou, son of man, hear what I say unto thee, be not thou rebellious like that rebellious host, open thy mouth and eat that I give thee. And when I looked upon when I looked, behold, an hand was sent unto me, and lo, a rule of a book was therein. And he spread it before me, and it was written within and without. And there was written therein lamentations and mourning and woe. Alright guys, so we see here where the prophet Ezekiel has actually received the word from God that he should share with the people and so we see that the Lord is also encouraging him not to be afraid because he knows the people that are there but he Lord the Lord our God still is letting his presence be known by his people that they will not forget him so they will not be able to say we know not of the Lord and the Lord knows the nature of his people and so he warned against it but he still wants to send out his word so that anyone who will hear and actually listen will be able to hear and for those who do not want to listen they are free to do so as well he knows their nature so he knows that that's within their nature and he's, he's still offering them the opportunity to remain with him and to draw close to him. And so I will say to you, will you draw close to God when he calls, when he sends forth a word? Or will you forsake his word and go about doing your own will, go about following the desires of your own heart? Right, and we see where it says that he took out, he wrote out the book, and the lamentations were in it. So, that is telling me that the Lord actually gave Ezekiel, allowed Ezekiel to see all that the people are actually saying, all that the people are basically somewhat rebelling because of rebelling about right and so guys i'm just gonna leave that right there okay <laughs> because there was a lot of lamentation that would actually take place even after this okay it was the woes of the people that would actually happen okay so he knows their pain so he's just letting them know i know your pain okay i know your your pain but listen okay so guys i'm gonna leave that right there please remember to continue to walk in your salvation and if you've not gained it then seek it 
there's no better time to begin than the present. Have yourselves a blessed day. Bye.